Stereo Rocker kick five for the winners. Jason Dunster was once again the Hawks shining light and finished with six. The game hadn't even begun when the fireworks hit Victoria Park. Greg Deer somehow found himself in the middle of the Collingwood pack as Craig Kelly braced himself for one of footy's toughest assignments. Deer and Monkhorst continued the pleasantries of the opening bounce and with a strong wind at their backs, the Pies jumped the Hawks in the opening turn. Dunstall's strength was proving a handful for Kelly and minutes later, the Hawks spearhead kicked his second. Measures the kick, pulls it back, goal! But Collingwood was dominating in the air as James, then Buckley inspired the Woods. The Magpies led by 40 points at the first change, but as the wind subsided at Victoria Park, the job became that much more difficult for Hawthorne and Rocker was growing in confidence. Rocker lines up. And while Dunstall brought up his 950th career goal, it was Collingwood by 32 points at half time. Butcher then gave Andy Collins a taste of the billboard, but there was no denying Rocker and the Hawks were becoming increasingly frustrated. By midway through the third term, it was all over. And while Hawthorne outscored their opponents in the final quarter, the Pies celebrated a six-goal victory. That is perfect. Melbourne finally returned to the winning list after three consecutive losses, with an easy 74-point victory against the pathetic St Kilda. The Demons kept the Saints scoreless in the first term and progressively ground them into the Waverley dirt.